Hi friends! This is Dainty Tank. Thank you for joining me. Welcome back to A Year of Springs. This is part three in our series. Poke Totoro in the upper eye card area. See the other two. It was adorable. We basically went back and replayed. We basically, we did go back and replay One Night Hot Springs, which was from the very beginning of our channel. Way back when, two years ago, which feels like 20. It just does. Anyways, I really appreciate you guys being around. This is actually new content for the channel because I don't think, I don't think, I ever got to post anything more from the series. Um, although I tried to play it. So I have some recollection of like it being Erica focused for the second game. But this is, uh, as the title says, a year of springs. It's the whole collection, the whole story that we're playing all at once. So thank you. Welcome back. Let's start. Oh, that was very cheerful. Yes. Last day of spring. And then there's spring leaves, no flowers, which we haven't unlocked yet. Again, special thanks. Game starts in 2019, ends in 2020. Right when we started. <laughs> okay. Okay. I gotta get that Erica voice going. I gotta have that rasp. Okay, let's do this. Ding dong. The witch is dead. Witch oh witch. Monday, April 1st. April Fool's Day. Oh my god. Today, the new era name was announced. Oh yeah, I guess they do have, like, era names. Riwa comes from the Manyoshu. Apologies for all the pronunciations here. And it's meant to represent it. It's the first time that an era name has been sourced from classical Japanese literature instead of news, 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 news. Uh, everyone's just talking about the new era name. Who even cares? Not like anything's gonna change. The emperor doesn't even do anything now. What's a new emperor gonna do? Ugh. Wonder what Haru's up to. Yo. Did you see the news? There has to be something better on TV. That noise is really bothering my autism friend. Hmm. <sighs> Guess not. Oh, <laughs> I forgot how cute that little beep is. <laughs> Every time it gets me. Oh, uh, that's probably Haru. Hi. What news? The new era name. Oh, that. Restart device. Later, bit, bit defender. Why now? I saw. Stupid, right? Sounds like the name of an anime character. Like, we should just get rid of it entirely. So annoying. I don't know. I think it sounds pretty. Oh. Uh, of course Haru would like it. I bet Manami likes it too. Such goody two shoes. Hey, have you met up with Maname lately? Not since we had the picnic at Shinjuku Go uh, Goyen. Why? No reason, just asking. The picnic, huh? Haven't really talked to Maname since then. I mean, that means you both haven't. Gotta yeah, turn on the fan, because it's hot. It's either that or I have a fever, because I had my uh, vaccine booster. Get, sh get shot up, get boosted. Oh no! Hold on. Gotta click off that, and then I have to click out of this, and then, then it works. Okay. <laughs> Ugh. Why am I watching the news? This is so boring. Wanna hang out later today? Sorry. Dinner with coworkers today since it's my first day. Oh, right. Hope that's going well. Watermelon. <laughs> right. Haru's a working adult now. It's weird how we're almost the same age, but I'm just a student and she's like full-fledged member of society. A full-fledged member of society? Let me know more about your work later. You don't 
You didn't tell me anything about it. It's not that interesting. Just tell me any way I want to know. Okay, after I get home then. Need to get back though, since the lunch break is over. Bye. Hmm, what should I do today then? I guess I could ask Manami if she's free. Nah. She's probably hanging out with her boyfriend anyway. I don't really have anyone else I want to ask. Uh, I guess I should just call her. Okay. Okay. Manami! Hey, Erica. Hey, Manami, you free today? Actually, I was just about to call you to ask the same thing. Oh, cool. Do you want to go to Alouette? Sure. Meet you there in 30. Okay, I'll see you soon. The beep! <laughs> hmm. Guess she was free after all. Better change out of the room clothes before heading out. Okay. You have room clothes? Hmm, maybe Manami- blah, blah, Hold on. Maybe Manami isn't here yet. Guess I could order first. Erica, over here. Huh? Over here, silly. I guess the table. <laughs> oh, thanks. I was just about to order first then. Actually, I already ordered us an afternoon tea set. Hope you don't mind. Not if you're paying. <laughs> My boyfriend paid, actually. He left just a bit earlier. So he swooshed in, paid for a whole afternoon ass tea, and then left? Okay. He left. Manama, you didn't have to tell him to leave. He said he didn't want to get in the way of our girl talk. That so? Why'd you want me up today anyway? I mean, y you were going to meet up. You were asking her to hang out. Like, what reason do you have to- I mean, what reason were you going to state? You were just bored? <laughs> oh, right. Wanted to ask if you were free this weekend. Well, classes don't start until next week and I'm a boring hobbit. Hermit? Hermit. So yeah, I'm free. Why? <laughs> That's great. I want to surprise Haru for her birthday. Sure. When's her birthday? Today. Oh. That's today? You didn't know? I thought she would have told you. You two talk so often lately. Well, she didn't. I guess she just didn't think to tell me. I'm going to go out on a limb and say that's awkward for her to try and talk to you about in a lot of ways. Like, when do you just casually go, oh, it's my birthday? Maybe that's me and my socially anxious type of mind where I'm like, not gonna bring it up. <laughs> I'm sure she just forgot. She's busy with her new job after all. I guess. I was planning on going to go out with her for dinner today, but she's going out with her co-workers. You were going to have a dinner together? Yup. Wanted to give Haru her presents on her birthday. I was planning on just dropping by her house later tonight. You could have, I don't know, invited me or something. Are you jealous, Erica? Could have, like, invited me. Oh, uh, Erica, I'm really sorry. I didn't exclude you on purpose. I just thought that Haru might be a little bit tired after her first day, so I kept just two of us. I think Haru would really like it if you were there this weekend, though. Is that okay? Yeah, of course. Sorry for being weird. I hope I didn't make you uh, feel left out, Erica. I'm fine. Can we just drop this topic? I feel jelly everywhere. <laughs> Are you really okay? No. I'm fine, Maname. Seriously. If you say so, then. I'm still thinking about what to do for Haru's birthday, though. Could you call me if you have any ideas? Yeah, of course. I also wanted to ask you, are you ready for, uh, classes? I'm a bit nervous since we're in our third year now. <laughs> I spent way more time at the cafe than I planned. I love Maname. But she can go on for hours. Haru's probably done... Probably done work by now. 
pro probably done the work by now. Yes, probably done with work by now? Probably that. Might as well send her a message. How was your first day of being a real working adult? Also, even though you didn't bother telling me, that was a dick move. You don't need to do that. Aw, cute gif. Happy birthday. Maybe that sounds a bit too salty. It's totally cool that you didn't tell me. I know you have work and all. I don't think that makes it any better. Ugh, why do I even care? <laughs> it's called being a friend and a good human, Erica. <laughs> Let's see what's on then. Ugh, more annoying neurodivergent pain. Now, let's take a closer look at the calligraphy of... People are still talking about the new era name. Who even cares? I don't know, Erica, apparently you care? Isn't there any real news on? This is ridiculous. The new era isn't even going to start until May. Uh, I'm just gonna take a nap. So you spent, you complained about spending more time at, with Manami than you had thought, and then you took a nap. So like, why are you like putting pressure on your schedule and complaining about your schedule when you're taking a nap? Like, not that I'm downing naps, I'm just saying, I do not understand you, Erica. What else were you going to do today? <laughs> Watch the news? Ah, that was a good nap. Hmm. No reply from her yet. Maybe she went straight to dinner with her coworkers without checking her phone. No, the message is on red. She left me on red? <gasps> She's just ignoring me. Or she read your message and didn't have enough emotional empathy and time to explain to you why she didn't include you in her birthday when it's her first day. Maybe that. I guess she might not have the time to respond, though. Yeah. Since she's eating dinner with her coworkers and all. Uh, why am I being so needy? I don't know. Why? This isn't like me at all. I should just... You should just be boop. <laughs> always, you should always just be boop. Beep boop, beep boop, beep boop, beep boop, beep boop. Maybe that's Haru. Haru unsent a message. What's Haru playing at? Didn't know you could unsend messages. Oh, I think I I looked this up and like it, if you're online, which is like the premier messaging service over there, then you can unsend a message. Are you at dinner? If you're busy, you don't have to reply. Message is on the red again, but still no reply. Beep boop. I'm gonna enjoy the beep boops. Unsent a message. Sorry. A sorry stamp? That's it? How are we acting weird? Hey, are you okay? Of course. Why wouldn't I be? Squid. Okay, something is definitely up. Do you want to talk? She's leaving me on red again. Okay, I'm gonna call. You can just ignore it if you want, but I'm gonna call. Calling now. Okay. No answer. Maybe she's really just... Haru! Hi. Hey. How was work? It was okay. Ah, that's great. Are you at dinner with your coworkers then? No. Huh? I didn't go. Oh. Why not? Sorry. Oh. There was a lot. There's a lot of feelings today. There's a lot of like emotions going on. Give Haru some time. What? She she hung up? What is she? Beep. Sorry, just 
I can't talk about it on the phone. Sorry. Okay, just calm down. And, uh, stop apologizing. What's wrong? God, I hope her coworkers didn't say anything awful. Was it someone at work? No, everyone is really nice. The work is fun too. It's mostly just sitting in front of a computer. Then, what's wrong? Maybe I should just go over to her house? That's a lot, Erica. No, that was just make it harder for her to talk. Yeah? It's really stupid. Just tell me. <laughs> work was really great. It's just... It was my first day, and I had to sign all these forms. Ah, uh, so that's it. I could use my own name for regular work stuff, but for the contract and everything... Yeah. I had to fill it out with my legal name. Sam. It's unfortunate you have to use your dead name for legal things unless you're able to change it. Which is a lot of an undertaking and just is stupid legal hurdles that don't make sense. And my legal gender... I don't know. Just thought... Since I'm officially an adult today, I just wanted to do my job with my actual name and gender, but I couldn't. Oh, Haru. Everyone's talking about Rewa. New era with a new start. I just wish I could have a new start too. Like I said, it's really stupid. Wow, I sent a lot of messages. Sorry. <laughs> I can't believe I was soaking about Haru's birthday earlier. I'm such an idiot. Yeah, a little bit, Erica. Yeah. Haru, I'm gonna call you now. <laughs> okay. Erica, why are you- Haru, are you free this weekend? I think I'm free, but- Okay, we're going out then. Keep the day open. I will, but- Good. Okay. And Haru? Yes? I don't care what it says on your stupid family register. You're Haru Suzuki, and you're an absolutely amazing woman. So just don't forget that, okay? I'm gonna hang up now. Meep. <laughs> Meep. I can't believe I just said that. I was really supportive. Good job. I can't believe I just said that. I feel like someone in a stupid TV drama. Okay, I just need to cool my head a bit, that's all. Oh, wait. Maname. Oh yeah. That one. Need to stop her before she goes to Haru's place. Haru's probably in no state to see anybody right now. Mm-hmm. Hey again, Erica. What is it? Don't give Haru the present tonight. Huh? Uh, I mean... I was just thinking that we could both surprise Haru with our presents on the weekend. Oh, that sounds great. I'll wait until we meet up then. Do you have any ideas about what to do? Actually, about that. Since you arranged your own birthday trip last time, I thought maybe I could do the planning this time to surprise both of you. Really? That would be so nice. It's been such a short notice and all. It wouldn't be too much trouble for you. It's fine. I want to do it. Okay then, I'll leave it to you, Erica. Just let me know if you want me to uh, prepare anything. Got it. Talk to you later. Beep. Okay, I just said all of that, but what am I going to do? Whatever, I'll work it out. The amount of bullshit confidence that you have in yourself, Erica, is beautiful. Never lose it. Haru is feeling down, so I need to cheer her up. And what better way to do that than a surprise birthday party? I can start planning the logistics and all tomorrow. For now, it's bedtime. You basically took a nap, woke up, messaged people, and then get right back to bed. <laughs> Good for you. Tuesday, April 2nd. I don't think there's been a single decision so far. Okay, I have until the weekend to plan everything. I should probably at least ask Haru if there's anything she wants to do, though. 
Yo. About this weekend. If we could, uh, if you could go anywhere, where would you go? Question, oh, pe question, pebble. Or like, if you could do anything you wanted, what would you want to do? Are you asking about places to go? Anything's anywhere is fine. Uh, that's not helpful. Sorry. I don't know where people usually go on weekends. I don't go out much. I just want to know where you want to go. That's asking a lot and putting a lot of pressure. It's basically asking like, hey, plan your own thing. Ugh. Like maybe somewhere you've always wanted to go, but never got around to or something you want to do, mm -hmm. but haven't had the chance to. I don't know. Sorry. Really don't go out much. This isn't getting anywhere. Maybe I should just think up some options and then let Haru choose from them. What do people usually do on their birthday? Within a regular uni student's budget. You'll have to apologize. I'll figure something out. Do you have work soon, right? Talk to you later. Okay, I'll try to think about it more. Bye! Birthday activities, huh? Let's see what the internet suggests. Good job! Use the internet instead of making your friend plan her own birthday. Oh, a page titled, What Do Women Want to Do on Their Birthdays? Who do you want to spend it with? Half chose their boyfriend's husbands. Doesn't really apply here. What do you want your boyfriend husband to give you? Let's just assume every woman has a boyfriend or husband. Heteronormativity. Unfortunately. Ugh, this site is awful. It does have a list of popular birthday activities, though. Go, go to a day spa, visit a theme park, hotel buffet, romantic dinner at night. Romantic dinner is out, but the others could work. Probably won't be that expensive, either. Manami and I could each chip in half to cover Haru. See what Haru thinks. Spa, theme park, hotel buffet. What do you think? Hmm... I guess I've never gone to a spa before. Wanna go then? Oh no. Probably can't. Why not? You know. <laughs> there we go! <laughs> Alright. I guess a spa might have the same issues that a hot spring does for transgender people. You are the most. Oh my god. You're the most carelessly caring human. <laughs> but I mean, the hot springs worked out last time. I'm sure I can figure something out. Don't worry about that. I'll deal with it. Do you want to go to a spa? Kinda, yeah. I'd like to. Awesome. It's a date then. As in, like, a date to go to the spa because we set the day for the weekend. So it is a date we set. Why am I even saying? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Oh my god. You're flustering at Eric. Erica, you're flustering at Harder right now. Thanks, Erica. I really appreciate it. Okay, stop being weird, Erica. You have a birthday thing to plan. See what spas there are around here. Hmm, there's actually quite a few. Didn't realize this was such a big thing. Come think of it, I've never gone to a spa either. They have them sorted out into categories, though. Ew, ew, ew. Yes, okay. Something savable. <laughs> okay, reasonable prices, super relaxing, pamper yourself. That would be too much. Reasonable prices. Let's go super relaxing. Harvest just out, so a spa with a super relaxing package would be good. Maybe massages or saunas or something? Let's see what options there are. This one sounds nice. Spa souffle. Why would you want to souffle you? No! Nope, don't do that. And internet, do not meme that. <laughs> it looks like... It looks very girls day out, though. What, if, what is souffle even supposed to mean here? <laughs> My question! Yeah! What is it supposed to mean? Looks super relaxing, though. 
It's got baths sourced from natural hot springs and jet baths too. Looks like they even have an area inside where you can apply mud masks. Stone sauna uses aroma oils. That sounds very nice. Cafe area, area looks super cute as well. They have hammocks and bean bags. Looks like they have a lot of magazines and books for you to read. Oh, they have comics and board games too. They even have massage and treatment options, though you have to pay separately for them. Prices, actually it's not too bad. 1400 yen per person, and that includes a stone sauna. If you don't want to book a room, it's more expensive though. Plus 200 yen per year. It's plus 2,000 yen per person. Looks like the only rooms are hotel style rooms. Probably meant for people who want to take a nap afterwards. The massage and treatment options are all pretty expensive though. Cheapest one is 3,000 yen. If I chose this one, you'll just read comics while Maname and Haru get a massage. <laughs> Overall though, this place looks really fun. I bet Haru would enjoy it. Do you want to check out more spas? Like, honestly, it sounds really good. Why don't you give them a call? Okay, I think I've decided. Let's go spa souffle. Looks really cute. I'm sure Haru would love it. Just need to book the date then. I should probably check with Maname and see what she thinks first, though. Let's give her a call. Hey, Erica. Did you sign on the place for Haru's birthday? It's a good question. Hey, Erica. Did you decide on a place for Haru's birthday? I did! There's this cute place called Spa Souffle. Have you heard of it? Oh, I think I saw it in a magazine. Is it the place with hammocks? Yeah. I wanted to go there ever since seeing the magazine feature. Perfect timing, then. It's a little bit far since it's out of the, pre out of the prefecture, though. Hmm, it's in Shiba, right? I don't think it'll take more than an hour to get there. We'll have to wake up early to go then. I think they have a lot of different options, right? Ah, uh, yeah. They have a long menu for massages and treatments. Do you want to meet up um, tomorrow to take a look at all the plans? Oh, that'd be really helpful, actually. Are you free? Yep. Do you want to meet up at Alouette? Sure. See you tomorrow then? See you. Beep! Beep. <laughs> okay, so I've chosen the location at least. Good job. I think that's enough work for today. Guess I could take this time to... Beep! A message! A message! Wonder who it is. Sorry. What's Haru apologizing for? What's up? Hmm, no reply. You're so Give them a minute. She has to sit there and message. Oh, Haru unsent a message. What's up with her? Is something wrong? It's nothing. Ignore me. I was just thinking. We don't really need to do anything for my birthday. I'm sure it's a lot of hassle. It's nothing special. Seriously, what's up with her? It's probably why she didn't mention it to you. And she didn't want it to be a big thing. There's a lot of feelings around this birthday. Does she not want a birthday party or something? Maybe I should call it off. Of course not, it's Haru's birthday. Tell Haru it's no hassle. Of course not. It's Haru's birthday. It's Haru's birthday. Of course we should do something. I'd be really weird if we didn't. <laughs> Nothing special? It's your birthday! Totally special. Happens every year though. Yeah, that's how birthdays work, Haru. You've, you've had 19 already. You should know the drill. I know, but... I don't usually do much for my birthday, just dinner with Maname. Maybe Haru just doesn't want to make a big event out of it, since it's always been just her and Maname before. Uh, maybe better to call this off. 
Okay. I'm going to play this as Erica. Like, really, if Haru was giving me this much pushback, I would tone it down from, like, a day trip down to, like, a personal party. That's what I would do. Make it something that's a little bit more intimate, just small scale for something that she doesn't want a big deal out of. However, this is Erica. This is all or nothing Erica. <laughs> this is the most caring, careless human there is. So no, it's still Haru's birthday. <laughs> nah, it's still Haru's birthday after all. We should do something a bit more than just dinner. Well, this year, you can do something different. I mean, you turned 22. You're an adult now. It is a big celebration. That's worth celebrating. <laughs> it really isn't too much trouble. It's totally fine, Haru. Yay. Okay, then. Anyway, that's enough work for today. I need to catch up on all the series I've been watching s before school starts again. <laughs> Are you really just sitting there binging? <laughs> what is Erica binging? That's what I want to know. What What is Erica binging all day? Wednesday, April 3rd. Okay, back to Alouette. Manami is thinking forever. <laughs> Erica, I got us some water. Ah, thanks. This boss souffle really does look cute, though. Yeah, I'm really pretty excited to go myself. Thanks for looking through the massage and treatment menu with me. No problem. I think it'd be fun to play some of the board games, too. They have so many I didn't know. Manabe, you've probably only ever played, like, Life in Manabe. Are those big over there? I don't think they are. And Manabe really sucks. Life, you can just cheat by literally just not getting any kids. And then you have all the money in the world to go through and deal with life occurrences. And that goes for actual life, too. <laughs> Which is so sad. Curse the American <laughs> system. <laughs> Children are literal burdens. And that sucks, because it puts so much on the, on the kid. I don't think I played Monopoly actually. Monopoly actually. I uh, have playing cards at home though. Figures. We probably don't. We definitely not playing Monopoly this weekend though. I'll let you choose what to play. I was like, yeah, don't don't play Monopoly for the birthday. <laughs> Sailors of Catan. Yes. Sheep for wood. Sheep for wood. Do you want to book? Sorry, my phone's vibrating. I think someone's calling me. You can get that. Sorry, I'll be right back. It's probably her boyfriend calling again. I swear, he calls her all the time. It's sweet of him, I guess. Sorry, Erica. Can I? Could you make the booking yourself? Completely forgot about my boyfriend wanted me to meet up today. Jeez, really? I can cancel if you want me to, though. i He's taking a lot of your time, according to your friends here. Of course, like, how reliable is Erica on this, though? I can't really judge. Nah, it's fine. Get me up with her boyfriend. I can handle things from here. Okay, call me if you need anything, okay? Okay, I guess I can make the booking then. What's the phone number again? Found it. Let's give him a call. Uh-huh. Hello, this is Spa Souffle. How may I help you? Hi, I'd like to make a reservation for three. While our rooms can be booked for day use, there are only two beds per room. How many rooms would you like to book? Uh, just the one? One room then? Oh, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Would you like to make reservations for massages or treatments? Please note that we only offer massages and treatments for women. Oh, about that. One of us is a transgender woman, but can she still get the treatment? Excuse me, would you uh, please repeat that? One of us is a transgender woman, but can she still get the treatment? Please, let me check with the person in charge. Okay. 
I'm sorry for the wait. Unfortunately, our staff are not trained to do massages on treatment or treatments on transgender women. Not trained? What are you on about? However, you may still enjoy our other faculties. We do request that guests use the facilities designated for their legal gender. That's unfortunate that this is a thing, and I am sorry that we are having to have these stupid conversations. A bathroom's a bathroom, a bathroom. But... Would you like to make a reservation? No, it's it's fine though. Thanks. Beep. This place is in there go then. Whatever. There are other options. Let me try calling some other places. You're gonna have a lot of the same issues. I sincerely apologize, but... <laughs> Unfortunately, we cannot... Ugh, I can't believe it. None of these places are okay with all three of us going, just going together. Ugh, why is everybody just so awful? That's a great question. Why is everybody so awful? And it's really just transphobia and it sucks. <laughs> what should I do? Tell Haru I deal with it, but I, I... Oh, it's a message from Haru. Hi. Is the planning going okay? Should I tell her? <laughs> she doesn't need this. She literally lives with it. Definitely not. Don't don't deal. Don't put the burden on her. She already is having to deal with this on a daily basis and probably would have thought about this well before you did. The fact that you're having to experience this is actually probably a good thing for you to be a better ally for her. So definitely not. No. <laughs> that would just make her sad. She doesn't need to hear about this. Everything's going great. It's gonna be awesome. Let me know if there are any problems, though. But what can I do, really? Nothing's going great at all. No, I can't give up yet. I'll look at the site again and check some of our other places. But I'll do that tomorrow. I think I need a break. You need a break every ten minutes. It's Thursday. Okay. Thursday, April 4th. Nothing. I probably called every single listing in the Tokyo area, but nothing. If I hear one more person say that they only let people use services for their legal gender, I'll... I'll... <sighs> like there's anything I can do. I told Haru I'd work things out. Like I could be her hero or something. It's so naive. That. Yes. You are so naive. Yes. I really don't want to disappoint harder though. Which I do. Oh! That's Maname. I should tell her that we need to change our plans. But I don't really... I really don't want to. I should at least pick up the phone though. I was about to say, are you saying this at your phone? Hey, Maname. Hi, Erica. I'm sorry. I had to leave early yesterday. Did you make the reservations? Uh, about that. It didn't work out. What didn't work out? The reservation. Why not? They had issue with Haru being transgender. <sighs> Maybe they just don't understand. I can talk to them in person. Don't, Maname. I called dozens of places yesterday. I got the same answer from everyone. But I think we probably should plan something else. Well, I'm sure Haru won't mind. Yeah, but that makes it worse. I just wanted to do something special for her birthday. Since she had a rough time at her first day at work and all. She did then? She didn't talk to me about it. Yeah, she probably didn't want to worry you. She seemed so happy when I suggested we go to a spa. Erica. I'll call you back when I figure something out. Huh. <sighs> I really don't want to tell Haru that the spa thing didn't work out. I don't know why people care so much anyway. Why is it so hard to find a spa that'll just let three women go together? Here I am complaining about this one thing now. When Haru must go through this every single day. Yeah. 
Yeah. You're just experiencing a taste of it, is the thing. You're experiencing a tiny taste of it. She already said that she probably wouldn't be able to go when I first asked. She already knew how everyone would respond. But I really don't want to prove her right. Isn't there any way Haru can enjoy a spa on her birthday? I guess I could look up spa alternatives on my phone. Instead of a spa, go to the hot springs to relax. It's just going to have the same exact problems. Come to think that staff at the Ryuken Maname booked were really accommodating. This isn't the norm though. The Super Sento is a great cheap alternative too. Nope, Super Sento is out too. Isn't there anything at all? If you can't afford a spa, try making your own spa at home. Huh? A spa at home? <gasps> Brain blast. <laughs> you could recreate a spa experience in your own home. Oh, this actually sounds okay. Buy spa goods and use them whenever you want at home. That yeah, is fun. Yes, it is fun. Here are some treatments you could do yourself. Hmm, that's doable. This too. This isn't quite the same as a spa, but this might not be too bad. Let's see what Maname thinks. Maname! Maname! Erica? Maname! <laughs> Let's make our own spa. Huh? I mean, we could do, the, do a home spa. Oh, that would work. So. A girl's day out. We can do a girl's day in. A girl's day in. I like the sound of that. I don't know how to do massages or that kind of stuff, but... I have face masks at home. I'd go shopping for some stuff, too. That sounds good. I'll check what stuff I have at home. We need a place to do this, though. I guess my place is okay, though it's a bit cramped. Oh, I've never been to your place before. This is so exciting. Okay, I'm going to go check on what I can bring. <laughs> Good job. You just so I I gotta go think of what to break. Click and you run. <laughs> That's what I imagine Maname is doing right now. I should probably also tell Haru about the change of plans. Good thing I didn't tell her I decided on a place at least, since it didn't work out. Um, should I tell her though? Save. Say it was too expensive. Don't tell her the details. Just don't tell her the details. She doesn't need to know what happened. I'll just tell her that I decided a home spa would be more fun. Yo. Hey, Haru. Thought about it, and... Rather than going out to some random place, I thought it would be more fun. Spa day of my place! What do you think? Stone question mark? Stone question mark? Wait, she's at work. She probably can't reply now. Sorry. Sorry for the spam. Get back to, get back to me after work. If we're holding Haru's birthday thing here, we have to clean up a bit. Guess now's as good as time as any to get in some spring cleaning. Okay. Ugh, this place is filthy. Who's just leaving their dirty clothes on the floor? Alright, that's me. Why do I do this to myself? Oh, nice. Ugh, this place looks so organized. I can mess it up again after Haru's birthday Beep. thing, though. Beep! Ah, that's probably Haru. Hi! Is it really okay? I don't want you to go to that much trouble. You don't have to prep it at home and everything. Maybe instead we could just do something else. Hmm, Haru doesn't seem really excited. I guess a home spa isn't really what she was- she's been expecting, though. Maybe we should do something else? Erica made a decision. She's not going to back down. Maybe we should do something. No, I can do this. The raw confidence of Erica. No, I can do this. Haru's just being Haru and trying not to let me let it be a bother. It's really neutral at all. I've really, I've never really done a spa before either, so it'll be fun to do a test run at home. Are you sure? Pebble question. Yeah. Don't worry. I've got it handled. Watermelon. Okay, but let me know if you change your mind. I won't. <laughs> I cleaned my apartment for this. It's a really big deal, just so you know. 
Thanks. Uh, it's been a really long time since I've got, gone to a friend's home. Don't expect much. My whole apartment is like half the size of Maname's room. That's fine. I'm looking forward to it. Aww. I'll send you my address later. Still need to prep though. Watermelon! <laughs> Bye! Sometimes I think Haru's messages messages more in stamps than in like actual words. That's fine! Talking memes! Talking stamps! I think this room is acceptable enough to show other people now though. Just need to buy stuff tomorrow and then everything should be good! Good job, me! I think I've earned myself the right to watch another few episodes. Binge your series! Hey friends! I had to cut this, it got too long. Obviously. We're continuing on next time on the same playthrough. It gets fun. Really excited to have you jump back into things. Really excited about playing this game. Thank you for showing up. Thank you for hanging out. Thank you for being here. Tap the Totoro, find more things. Tap the description because I always put links down there. Also, just subscribe while you're at it, while you're tapping things. Thank you for everything. Can't wait to see you next time. I love you all. I'll see you soon. <laughs> Bye!